Greetings and welcome back to Mansu. Last time we conquered Irat and this time we're gunning for Ming. He just changed his mandate. He took a decision that dropped his mandate below 50, which we. <clears throat> hmm. Which we are trying to exploit right now. He's getting uh, plus 27 something. Something, something. I think we are to cancel tributary now. What? I didn't know that we were losing stability if you cancel tributary status. But yeah, well, too bad. We have to do it. I wonder if 28 are enough. They shouldn't be. <clears throat> Is he still fighting? Yeah, he's still fighting. Let's also core anything that we can core. Okay, let's take these ones first. These are the easy ones. Wait, 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 wait. Did I raise everything? First of all. Yeah, seems like it did. Did I raise those? No, I didn't. Yeah, this is right. Okay, is this right? 25% of 50 is 12.5. Gets it to 37. 37. Yeah, divided by 2. It's not right. 25% of 60 is 15. 45 divided by 2 is 22, not 23. Let's wait a bit for them. <clears throat> okay. Well, I wonder, do we attack now? <clears throat> One second. Okay, I'm back. Let's check the sound. Sorry for this. Sound is good. Okay, everything is good. Let's see. Um, Ming should have about uh, 50 something thousand armies. Has 83,000 right now. But he should have a problem with mercenaries when he goes to. Yeah, available mercenaries less and less. Hmm. Interesting. We have to get him to zero mandate. The thing is, it's better for us to wait. Because the more we wait, uh, first of all, he loses more mandates. Secondly, the event of uh, having a horde in his borders with 300 development and more is going to proc. So when it procs, we're in business. 
What? No. Why would I? The fuck? 67. It's kind of late for us to be fighting Ming. We should have done it a bit earlier. But it's good. I mean, this is the point where he drops his mandate first. doesn't move there we don't attack him because we can raise this and effectively pay for the whole thing um. eh. uh. I'm bad uh, I'm not good at money right now it's too much it's too much money man and the money can become admin points in this expansion because you can go up to uh, plus 5 advisors and not only plus 3 so you can actually make your money monarch points so I don't want to destroy my economy I won't give access to no one 17.3 eh? if they are at war with us and losing they go even lower, so let's... Um... <clears throat> no, I don't want only the cores. Oh, right. Yeah, 18. Yeah, this is right. Okay, let's wait one more month to go to War Exhaustion Zero. This is the point where we have to see what are we going to do. Now if I go for Conquest, no, Conquest is bad. We have to go for Tribal Conquest, so that we get a ticking war score when we win wars. Thing is, we need better generals. Can't get generals from them. Can I do any of the others of these other guys? Two countries allied with one too. I don't know. Are they good enough? Diplo rep? Ah, we don't really care for this here right now. Um, five temples and five workshops. Nice. It's not bad. Silk Road, we can do it. We can't do that either. Assembly an army. 8,000 strong. And have... What What does he want? One power recovery, land maintenance for 20 years. That's good. He needs all those. Yeah, I was I was going to take those anyways. This is what we were going to take. Of course, we want to take these guys too, because these claims are not permanent. They're temporary. But I think we're going to attack... Uh, wait, are they in the China region? These ones are not. The other ones are in the North China region. Which means... We get a claim for them, a permanent one. So, better not take those. But take those only. This is not in North China either. I don't think I will ever take, get a claim for Inner Mongolia. But yeah. <clears throat> I'm kind of hesitant of attacking him. I shouldn't be. Yeah, let's attack and see how it goes. This is a fort, okay. Uh, we wanted some generals. It's kind of okay. Let's take this fourth guy. Six. Okay. I think like that is good. Not this fourth guy. 
Beijing is level 3 fort. So let's not deal with it yet. Okay, and I can take this guy. Tell him to go there. Okay, now I have this problem. Cannot go there, right? So let's go for that fort with this guy. So then let's take this guy. What is it? And this guy. There we go. This is more like it. Go there. Take one guy, go there. Take one guy, go there. Now I wonder <clears throat> is Mink going to attack me? Or is she going to keep on fighting the other guy? Thing is, now that we're fighting Ming, if we get to 10% or 25% war score, his mandate will start falling even even faster. Because if he's losing the war with the 300, um, 300 strong ten, uh, f fuck step a horde, <clears throat> then he loses mandate even faster. Blockade. Well, that's okay. That's expected. Okay, I think... I think I'll risk this. Get this to become a bit slower so we can get a chance at Beijing before his armies come around. Oh, he's coming. Um, sure. He is going somewhere. Maybe we should get him. Now this is desert and steppes. We shouldn't be fighting in the mountains. He's conquering those. Oof. This seems like a lot. Well, at least it's so superiority. So if we get the forts, we're kind of okay. Because then we can clear his army. Nice, this fort is going well. We kind of rust it, so this is good. No. <laughs> it's fine. Because he's fighting two wars. Uh, we can actually do this pretty easily. It wasn't such a big deal in the end. Okay, that's good. Oh, did he stop the core creation of this guy? What? Have I not even started it? What's it called? Kobdo. Probably I can't core it. And I didn't start it. I don't know. We'll learn soon. <coughs> oh, another loan. God damn it. Yes. Beautiful. Oh, 
Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go down and kind of carpet him. But also we want to hit his armies at some point. He went to mandate 11. If we manage to get him to zero, it would be really great. He seems to be going after his war. He won't stop. I'm kind of scaled up. It's probably fucked. We are one of the great powers of the world. Beautiful. Beautiful. We're coming for you, Poland. Give me one second, sorry, guys. And I'm, I'm, I'm kind of disappointed because uh, we didn't have to fight the war and I couldn't show you how bad Ming is with low mandate so yeah it's kind of counterintuitive because you think you can't win him 17 troops okay, fasting. he's going somewhere probably we'll have to chase after him some point. Should I do it now? Yeah, I have two armies for this reason. Now this is mountains, so we're not fighting him there. Oh crap! I thought he was going to push him out. Well, at least we're defending in mountains. So we should be able to win this. It's mountains and we're defending. It's not of a river, which is kind of unlucky. Okay, so um, let's see here. He has way lower morale than us because of all the events and stuff we were getting. Uh, this is actually some kind of a guide for fighting Ming. Oh, we're ahead of uh, we're ahead in technology too. But yeah, what I'm going to say is, uh, this is when you're this strong when you're playing one two, do that. And then just attack Ming. He's not as big and as threatening as he seems. Look at this. Complete destruction. On mountains. And we're Steppe Horde. Uh, we want to be fighting on Steppes. And stuff like that. Uh, I don't know. Should I be explaining the whys? For instance, why we want to be fighting on Steppes? Not sure. I'm not gonna do it now. But uh, yeah, please let me know in the comments. If I should be explaining um, more stuff, or if I'm explaining enough, and I'm getting boring. So either I'm getting boring. <laughs> I'm t talking too much about this. Okay. What is this? Oh crap. 
the cutscene guys, right. 24k, eh? Well, this hasn't progressed, so let's uh, kind of... We won't find the court scene, so... Just take a little bit of land here. Now, how much army does Ming have? Uh, it has 34 mercenaries. And 73 something normal army. So very soon he won't be able to recruit any more mercenaries. Also, why hasn't the event fired? Or did it fire? Let me see. Um, Ming... Disaster. It's a disaster. It's called Unguarded Nomadic Frontier. He needs to be the Emperor of China, does not have the disaster before. 300 Steppe Horde does not have a truce with the Emperor of China, does not have an alliance. If it's at war, it gets faster monthly progress. Okay, right. So it's a monthly progress thing. I forgot the mechanics of disasters. Yeah. So normally what you do is you fight here. Uh, for these provinces here. And you hope the disaster fires quickly. But... Um, Actually, attacking him when the mandate is low works too. This is what I suggest. Wait for his first mandate choice, this one, and attack then. Okay, let's take care of Kurtzin first. They're going to rebel soon and I don't want to be fighting both Ming and rebels at the same time. is high too. What? Come on, man. Well, it's all good around here. Let's get a better guy here. No, we don't have any good better guy than him. down there Cuts in belt it's a 24 stack let's take care of it hmm stack on flat terrain and we have two shock more I think this is going to be interesting this is going to show you how strong Mansu is against Ming it's flat we rolled zero on the first roll we caught some stuff He's going with everything he has there, right? Well... What do I do? Oh man! It's happening! We're getting fucked! This is not going to be fun! Oh, we're actually winning this! Beautiful. So freaking strong. I didn't check how big this was. It was 36 strong for Ming and 11 strong for us. 
three time our army and we beat him this is one two supremacy for you it's not over a river so let's let's try and get him with the best uh, with a good guy though not with this one now we have to reinforce them and go somewhere there probably this is 49% and it's sticking upwards because we won all the battles and it's so superiority you should always go for so superiority uh, innovativeness nice come on nice he got attrition cute ooh it's pretty low morale hmm I think I'll go against him like that. So. <coughs> we are kind of in a bad state. Mandate should fall to zero soon though. And he has uh, a what he what? He has 40,000 troops right now. We have to get him at zero, so Ming explodes and everything becomes little small Chinese nations that we can conquer. So we were actually covering Kobodo. I won't use this army for rebel suppression anymore, I'll just get him down to Ming. Oh wait, this guy has no leader. Yeah, it happened. So, they tell us of the nomadic frontier, Ming loses stability and mandate. Is the disaster I was talking about. But it doesn't really matter right now because... Oh, does he have disaster? Yeah, unguarded nomadic frontier. So I think for him to stop this disaster, he needs to kill us completely or make us his tributary, which is very improbable. 16 days okay yeah we'll get it and now that we have an open field like that let's get him a good general let's get him another good general which do we prefer I think I like the maneuver one better one fire is not going to do anything right now okay we won we have space marines man we have fucking space marines hmm Okay, yeah. We have to kill Buratia before anything else. Before he moves again. We're gonna have a problem. We don't want to conquer this province. <laughs> so yeah, let's go after Buratia. And let's let Mink have a little fun. For now. We have a ticking war score against him anyways. And he's fighting another guy. Started losing against him too. Yo, <laughs> no guy is clearing up our guy, uh, our mess here. Oh, he stopped. Come on, no guy. Why well, you got to have these negative vi negative vibes? What is this? What did I win against? Oh, Buratia, okay. Right. Yeah, we had to fight now. Um, my god. We don't have anything from the Age of Discovery. Well, we don't really care for anything of those either. Yeah, this could be good. But meh. We probably won't colonize. Cavalry armies is usually good, but not now. War taxes would be good, actually. So, did we have a chance to humiliate someone and we didn't take it, right? Yeah. Oh well. We'll have Beijing. So we'll have the 30 city. We'll see after that.
So he stacked a freak ton of troops there. Okay. I'm back again, sorry for this. I have problems with my throat. <laughs> okay, I didn't take this. So I kind of want to be occupying these two. So I'll work towards that. I would love if I'd finish with uh, Uratia soon. Okay, let's go, let's go towards there. Somewhere there is good. There we go. Beautiful. Raise it and let's take the idea. Hoo hoo hoo. Sexy. Yeah, let's wait for the next idea to its more, even more core creation cost, and then we'll see. Oh, he got the fort. A crazy bastard. How much army does Ming have now? Has 47,000 troops strong. He can't take any more mercenaries. So whatever mercenary we killed, he can't take him out again. So we have to clear his troops. So that he has zero troops. So that we... Um, we don't really care for the tribes anymore. Very soon we're not gonna have tribes, so let's just use this thing there. Let them be unhappy, whatever. Wait! What? What's this? How did I get this province? I don't understand. I thought it was Ming's. That's why I was sending troops there. Okay. I don't... Oh man. It happened. Okay, so... We have to go away. Yep. Yeah. Take this and this. They're not in China. Doesn't want to give those. Oh well. Okay, I think if we get his troops, we're good. If we get his troops, we are good. So let's actually hide these guys there. Something, something, Yeren? Truce with Yeren ended. Great! We have great opportunities here, boys. We have some great opportunities for you guys. Okay, we're actually close.
Yeah, he's going in against us. Oh well. We should fight him then. Close. But not quite so. This is in China, so we don't want this yet. Because we want to take the perm claims. We want those. If we can't, those are enough because we have the claims there. So this is this doesn't make any difference either we take it now or later. Is what I mean. Whatever, just give him, just, just give them one land, uh, which has high autonomy. Give them this one, whatever, and tell them we want uh, new horses and manpower. I'm not going to. Hmm. Nice one. Okay, let's kill this one then. Six shock. Beautiful. What was I saying? I'm not going to raise any of the Chinese provinces because they are of Chinese culture, which we are going to change into. Oh, we could raise the Mongol ones. Eh, for very minor profit. So then, us getting below the thingy here is no problem. Also, let's actually not get below. Just give them, give the tribes more stuff, whatever. Sure. How are we on the peace treaty? Well, I'm not going to actually replace him yet. We're just going to stay like this. It's going to be beautiful. Beautiful. Nice. Okay, yeah. Ah, not nice. <coughs> we are going to take another loan from what it seems. Let's take it now. Ah, he is there. Okay. He pissed out with Tsagatai. And we have more separatists now. I would love some good old-fashioned money let's not take the Mongolian claims let's take a lot of money to get our to get our debts out of the way okay now mission fulfilled Manpower recovery, land maintenance, yeah sure, even though we don't need it. I could have kept it for the future, but I don't. I don't like having to remember things. And yeah. Do we actually raise anything? We did raise there. I can raise there. We shouldn't raise anything. But why should we raise them? Yeah. It's not good. Beautiful. Just press the button. We have a better color than you. We have a better name than you. And we are better than you. Yes. Take it, Ming. Take it, boy. This 
This is beautiful. This is really beautiful. Look at this. Brings tears to my eyes, guys. This is the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. Well. Oh my god, this is Manchurian culture. Yes. Oh, we changed religion, right. So, let's go and uh, instantly harmonize with uh, Varayana. Positive stability. Yeah, 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 yeah. We have to actually have high stability. Oh, just positive stability. Okay. There's nothing else that helps then. This is beautiful. What? What tribes? We're the spotic monarchy. <laughs> what do you mean the tribes? <laughs> yeah, so we have to uh, revamp our whole army. Do we have any new? Construct a forbidden city. Stability 3. You have 2000 ducats. And have admin skill of 3. Oof, beautiful. Okay, well. We have to make those cores. But I should think I'll wait. Order restored. Oh, right, it's because of the peace treaty. And the peace treaty. I still get penalties. Okay. So, this little trick. There's a little trick you can play on Ming after you do this. <laughs> oh, what? They're subject to Ming, which will protect them. We have a truce with Korea, but um, we can attack Yeren. Oh, man. It's bad. Oh, what's this? No. This should never have come out. It destroyed my economy. Oh, we have to do a lot of things. And I'm kind of tired right now. <laughs> yeah, so. We have to reorganize our army into better divisions. First of all, we can't have more than 50% cavalry. And why is that? Why is it at 50%? Was it always 50%? Yeah, anyways, we have to have only 4 cavalry. Oh, I shouldn't have deleted those cavalry there. Crap. That was a mistake. And we're gonna pay a lot of money for our army right now, I think. Yeah. We'll have to reorganize the whole army. And then see what we're gonna do next. We're probably going to attack Yeren with Korea. Which is kind of bad, sad. Because we wanted to attack Ming somehow again. To eat from him again. As he has low low mandate now. And he's getting even lower. We should hit him now that he's down. Oh well. We are going to take the mandate from him. That is for sure. When we take the mandate we're gonna go and rush core creation cost stuff. Look at this. 10% there, and then there's another 10% somewhere here. 10% here, 20%. And we get 
20 more, 40% from our ideas, 25 from them, 65% core creation cost. And with the permanent claims, this goes down to 90%. So you pay 10% of the cost for core for coring stuff. And yeah, now that I think about it, it's not such a bad idea. Take the mandate, then conquer the whole of China. Yeah. So guys, I'm going to reorganize stuff around here, and I'm I'm going to see you next time on uh, King of China, Ting, China King, Empire of China. Well, isn't China coming from Ting? I don't know. See you guys next time on Heart on <laughs> Hearts of Fire, <laughs> on Europa Universalis for uh, Ting of King, King of Ting, Ming. No, not Ming. Ming is bad. Goodbye.